mommy, can you help me go over the apple bet? Sure, Jeffy. It's the alphabet, Jeffy, not the apple bet. No, it's the apple bet. Alphabet. Then why does A start with apple? Apple starts with A. Well, hold your tongue and say apple. Why? Because it's funny. Just do it. Asshole. Asshole! <laughs> Jeffy, don't cuss. You said it first! No, I didn't. I said asshole. Asshole! Marvin, it does kind of sound like that. Sound like what? Asshole! Jeffy, stop cussing! Jeffy, give me the cards and let me help you. Uh -huh. All right, here we go. Ready? A, B, C, D, Ugh. E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, There's no rhythm. Q, R, S, T U V double V. Wait, wait, wait. What, what'd you just say, Jeffy? Double V. No, that's a double U. No, it's a double V. Cause look, see, you got a V right there, and if you put two V side by side, it makes a double V. No, that's a double U. Well, now you look right here. See, that's a U, and the U is rounded, and the V is pointy. If you put two pointy V's together, you get a double V. And if it was really a double U, they'd be rounded, and it would look like boobies. Well, I understand that makes sense, but it's called a double U, not a double V. Well, I think they should change it. Well, they're not going to change the alphabet, Jeffy. It's the way it is. Well, I'm going to sue. Who are you going to sue? I'm going to sue the alphabet. Well, you can't sue the alphabet, Jeffy. That is a double U. It'll always be a double U, no matter how much sense you're making. No, it's a double V, and I'm going to let someone know about it. <sighs> He's so dumb. Order, 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 order. I am the Honorable Judge Pooh and today we will be hearing the case of Jeffy versus the alphabet. Jeffy is suing the alphabet because he wants the letter W to be called double V. Uh, one thing, real quick. Uh, since the alphabet is not a person, uh, Bailiff, who do we have here representing the alphabet? Well, Your Honor, we have this dictionary, and it's full of words and letters, so I guess that's kind of like the alphabet, and I guess his name would be Webster. I mean, it has 20,000 words in it, but, I mean, there's actually 140,000 words in the English language, so I don't really know how they decided which 20,000 words to put in here. I guess it's just kind of like the top. 20,000 words. Like, they should have called this, now that's what I call words. It's just kind of the best of. But anyway, we're using this as the alphabet. Oh good, we can start then. Jeffy, tell me why you think the letter W should be called double V. Mommy, get in here! Well, Your Honor, most people call this letter a W, when in fact it should be called a double V. Because this letter right here is a V. And if you put two V's side by side, it makes a double V. This letter right here is a U. Notice how it's rounded on the bottom, and on the double V, it's pointy like the letter V. So this letter right here should be called a double V and not a double U. Hmm, interesting. Let me see those cards. Yes, let's see how. Hmm, hmm. Yes, I suppose you're right. It does look more like a double V than a double U. <laughs> Jeffy, you are a very smart young man. Oh, that must be my phone alarm. Oh, yes. <laughs> I have low blood sugar, so it's time for my daily Big Mac. It's bad for my cholesterol, but you only live once. Mm. 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 That is delicious. <laughs> oh, my heart! I'm having a Big Mac attack! Help me! Your Honor, are you okay? I'm having a heart attack. Someone help me. Sir, I'm a doctor. I can get you to a hospital right away. But, but who's going to take over your judge duties? Him. That boy. He's a genius. I trust him to make good decisions while I'm in the hospital. Really? Him? That doesn't seem like a good idea. Are you questioning my orders? I choose him! Now get me to a hospital immediately! Right away, sir! <sighs> you, boy, you're the judge of this courtroom now! Everybody do what he says until I get back! Sir, we have to go right now! You are the judge. What you say goes! I'm the judge now? That's awesome! Order, order, order! <laughs> I'm Judge Jeffy, and there's going to be some changes around here. And my first rule is that the letter W will be now called the letter double V. Anyone who calls it W will be sentenced to 50 years in prison. And also, if I find someone innocent, they'll get a good boy sticker. All right, bailiff, I'm ready to hear my first case. Okay, Your Honor, this is Goodman, and he was arrested on tax evasion. It's my hard-earned money! I shouldn't have to give it to poor people! He hasn't paid his taxes in 12 years, which is a very serious crime. Listen, Judge, this is a suitcase full of cold, hard cash. I'll give it to you if you just let me go! And that's bribery, which is another charge. Come on, just take the money. Don't take the money. Simon says take the money. Hmm. I'll take the money. Bring it here. Here you go. You can't do that. 
All right, thank you very much. I find this man innocent. And don't forget your good boy sticker. Thank you. All right, bailiff, I'm ready to hear the next case. Hey, Your Honor, you can't be doing that. Doing what? Letting people bribe you to get away with their crimes. But I'm the judge. Well, yeah, but as a judge, you have great power. And it's like Spider-Man says after he does that wrestling match to get money to buy a new car to impress Mary Jane. He says, I need that money. So I need that money or else I'm going to tell the other judges that you take bribes. <sighs> All right, fine. Take this and shut up and bring me my next case. Okay, whatever you say goes. <laughs> okay, Your Honor, this next case is a single... <laughs> shut the hell up. Your Honor, this next case is a single mother who was caught shoplifting. She claims she was trying to steal food to feed her son. I didn't have much money this month. Times are hard. Hmm, what kind of food was she stealing? She stole a can of green beans, sir. Oh, guilty. Guilty, 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 guilty. Knife, death, electric chair, take her to the cell. And also, you tried poisoning your kid by feeding him green beans, so attempted murder. Guilty. Okay, off to the cell we go. No! Also, new law, green beans are now illegal. Anyone caught in possession of it is now sentenced to death. Bailiff, bring in my next case. Okay, Your Honor, your next case is this woman I caught on the street trying to sell, well, herself. Well, times are hard. Yeah, when I arrested her in the back of my cop car, she offered me a whole bunch of nasty stuff, and I only took her up on one or two of those nasty things, okay? I'm a man. I have needs, after all. But still, what she did is illegal. And so is what I did, but we're cool, right? I didn't hear a word you said, but all I know is that you arrested an innocent woman! She's free! To go underneath this desk, because I just came into a lot of cash, and now it's sticky. Okay. Look, I'm not going to argue with this one. I'll go get the next case. What do you want me to do? Just take some cash and go sit down there. I'll deal with you later. Okay. Next. Okay, Your Honor. Our next case is this homeless guy I found outside peeing on the courthouse. So that's public urination. Aliens took my right ear. He's homeless. Where else is he supposed to pee? He's innocent. Come up here and get your sticker. All right. Go get your sticker. All right, here's your sticker. It matches your shirt. <laughs> sticker man. Now you get to go pee wherever you want. I'm gonna go pee on a school bus. All right. All right, bring in my next case. Okay, Your Honor, I caught these two posing as debt collectors and calling elderly people to steal their credit card information. Look, Judge, they willingly gave us that credit card information. See, they all, what they gonna spend that money on? Teeth? Coffins? Exactly, baby. Now look, Judge, before you try to send us to jail, I would like to offer you something. My wife, see, she has some services that you can't get no else on this planet. Now pop it to that, baby. Hey there, big boy. I don't want to go to jail. Eh? Eh? Well, that position's already been filled. Well, actually currently being filled, so you're guilty. And also, I order you to pay back all the money that you've stolen, so however much that is, just calculate that with a calculator. Also, go to jail for like a day. And also, no sticker for you. No sticker! You suck, Judge. It's because we're black, baby. Damn right, homie. Shit's hot out here. Talk that shit, baby. Next case! Okay, Your Honor, this is Bubbles. Uh, he's been in jail for a long time. Not long enough, because I ain't got your cute ass yet. <laughs> uh, I don't like the way he looks at me. Uh, I'm getting worried. Anyway, the reason he's here is because he does unspeakable things to his cellmate. The most recent thing is that he branded his name on another inmate's ass. Yeah, it's my booty. I own that booty now. Well, well, see, what happened is he said that another inmate tried to take that booty, and he said his name wasn't on it, so he put his name on the booty. Yeah, I own that booty now. My booty. Okay, well, just to be clear, he doesn't own another inmate's ass. You, you can't do that. I did that. Okay, well, I still separated them, but now during rec time, he calls it erect time, and he finds them out on the yard. Yeah, because when I like you, I want you. And I get you. Yeah, he says <laughs> he says that a lot, too. We tried putting him in solitary confinement, but then when the guards go to bring his food, he convinces them to open the door, and then it's just over. Yeah, I'm a bloodhound for that ass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he Yeah, is. you see this number right here? <laughs> That's how many booties I got. <sighs> 582 booties and counting. Yeah, we have to make him a new jumpsuit every day. you number 583. I suggest we euthanize this man. <laughs> well, was anyone else's name on the booty? Well, no, Your Honor. No other inmates are claiming to own another man's ass in prison. Well, I guess since no one else's name was on it, finders keepers. He's innocent. Come get your sticker. But Your Honor! <laughs> I told you, I guess what I want. <laughs> now meet me in the bathroom in 10 minutes. Clean up while I get my sticker. <laughs> okay. All right, what color sticker do you want? I want the color of the inside of the booty, red. <laughs> mm.
All right, next case. Okay, Your Honor, we caught this kid spray painting a stop sign so it says go, and he caused a 10-car pileup. What, loser? You're a judge now? Yeah, I am the judge now, and I don't even care what he did. I sentenced him to 10 years in jail, and when you get out after 10 years, come see me and I'll give you 10 more years. What, 10 years? Yeah, you heard him. He's the judge, so come on. Come on. Shaboon! Next case. Okay, Your Honor, this is Chef Pee Pee. He got caught stealing from the salad bar to Ruby Tuesdays without paying for it. Look, Judge, I ate dinner there, and I still paid for my meal. I was walking out, and I decided to just pick up a little cherry tomato and eat it at the salad bar. Yeah, look, I paid for my meal. I still paid for the meal. Yeah, but you didn't pay the $8.99 for the salad bar. <laughs> what? Cherry tomatoes are gross. Guilty. Six months in jail. Six months in jail for one cherry tomato? Jeffy, I'll kill you. Come on. All right, next case. Hey, Your Honor, there's actually no more cases left for the day. Oh, well, in that case, can you send in my mommy and daddy? But they didn't do anything to get arrested. But I summoned them to my courtroom! Okay, if you say so. Uh, what's going on? Your son's the judge now. What? Aw, Jeffy, you look so cute with that little hammer. Daddy, hold your tongue and say apple. Why? Do what he says. He's the judge. <sighs> apple. Don't cuss in the courtroom. I was saying apple. Ugh. All right, Daddy, what were you going to feed me for dinner tonight? Uh, green beans? Jail. Jail? How long, sir? I don't know, just jail. Take him away, but not mommy. What? Okay. What? No, Debbie, I hate you! Hello, everybody, I am back! Good news! It turns out I did not actually have a heart attack. It was just angina. I know it sounds like a dirty word, but it's actually not. It's just chest pain. Okay, Jeffy, bequeath me my seat back. I can't queef. No, bequeath. It means to give. Give me my seat back. Okay. Yes, thank you. Mm. Oh, it feels good to be back. Oh, hello. What is your name? I see you left me a little gift. Mm. So, Jeffy, how was it being a judge? It was pretty cool. People had to listen to what I, I say. Mean, oh, my phone's ringing. Hello? Put Jeffy on the phone. Oh, okay. Jeffy, here. It's for you. Yellow. Listen, Jeffy, you put me in jail, but you didn't tell him how long I was supposed to be in jail. So can you please tell him how long? Yeah, just let me know when you want him out. I don't know. Depends on if you're going to take me to Chuck E. Cheese every day. Jeffy, tell him to let me out right now. Hmm. Tell me you won't feed me green beans anymore. No, I won't feed you green beans. All right, tell him I'll let you out. Okay, got it. All right, you're free to go. Okay, thank you. So, how was jail, Marvin? You know, jail gave me a lot of time to think. Think about how I'm gonna beat your ass, Jeffy! Well, I'm gonna call the judge and tell on you! What? I'm calling the judge and telling on you! Wh what? Hello? Hey, judge, it's me, Jeffy. Jefferoni and Cheese, the J-Man. J-E-F-F-Y, because I have to. Ah, Jeffy, my man, homie. <laughs> I'm very grateful for the suitcase of cash you left me, and the young lady. Be gentle with her. She cost me a smooth 10K. But I was calling because my daddy's trying to beat me, so tell him to stop. Tell him if he does not follow orders, he will meet my wrath. Bye! You hear that? Yes. Yay, we fixed the apple bed! Now take me to Chuck E. Cheese! But I'm tired, Jeff. Take me to Chuck E. Cheese! Okay. okay. Yay, Chuck or Cheese!